Hello everybody, how's everything? You guys doing good too? I'm doing good too. Let's get on today's video session. Here we go. Today we're going to do for this two hours you smart boy Yeah, how do you like my rock and roll music as always? So welcome back on my video session today and I'm very grateful I'm back for the video session Yeah? What thing I wanted to point out to you that it was this is gonna be really really interesting okay today I'm gonna to be reviewing the Pajistu Arrow Arrow with the Arrows U smartphone okay this is the box of this smartphone there is soft bank there, okay? Right here. I don't know why they do that. This phone was made by Vegistu. I don't know why it doesn't mention Vegistu on there. I have no clue. I don't know why. They just ignored it. Arrows. It is arrows here, by the way. This is the back of the box. Okay. All around the box. Pretty plain box, nothing special really. I don't know why they make this smartphone box is so plain. Right, when you open it, it looks like that. I've took everything out of the box, so I don't know why I'm just showing. It. Yeah, you take it out. Okay, you get all that stuff out of there. Yeah, yeah. Okay, and you get all this stuff. We're gonna take them all out. Oh. Right, we take you all out here. Right, Plain. Basically, there was this was on top of the smartphone, You're on the screen, Don't for protection. Right, you get all this. Okay, you get this manual stuff. Let's open it up. This is a proper review by the way, so I hope you guys will like it and it's pretty interesting to see what's in there. This is the phones from like Japan and for just two hours you is made in Japan, the smartphone is. And this is only in Japanese. I don't know if can, I can't read it. Oh, I don't know if you guys can read it. Okay, very nice. I told you it was up for just two hours you. Right, where does he actually say that? First of all, this is it. <laughs> it's got funny cartoons on there. Okay. Yeah? And if you look around here, look. See? Arrows, you. I told you. Very nice. Oh, don't worry with this. Is that? Alright. That's done. And then you got this booklet. <laughs> wow. They gave a booklet. So 
Slow down again, Japanese. Come on, my lad. Right. The accessories you get with it, right? You get this. You get that. That's a key, isn't it? That key, right? Do put it there. It looks like that. That point thing goes into a hole of the slot on the left hand side. I will actually show you that. Don't worry. Just looks like that. Okay. We will look into that. This is the charger you get with it. First of all, I'm going to open this up. The type on the other. Okay. There you go. And so it starts from here. Do -do 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 -do. Do -do 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 -do. Look at that. Comes up. Do -do. The cable is pretty long. I'll say it's a C type connector. Yeah. Very nice. Let's show you the charger properly. The charger looks like that. Take a look at that. That's the side. Looks really nice. That's the side. And this is the back. If you look down here, you pull that out. See that? Where it does. It gets pulled out. Gets pulled out. Yeah? It comes all the way down. Check it out. We're going to look into that as well. A bit more. In order to work this in the UK, right? You need a step down transformer. With 100 with 100 volts yeah I bought a step down transformer May uh, it was made it's made in yeah, I've got this in Britain right and this uh, item is made in the UK okay it's a really respected company uh, who make this they made this really really well I'll give them good respect for that this is made in England. Yeah, it's made in England, man. Incredible, isn't it? Check this out. British product made in England. Excellent, isn't it? Look. Right there. Made in England. This is where that two pin will go in there. Okay? That side, that side, the top, the bottom, and there you go, a three pin plug. <laughs> it's very <bit> heavy. <laughs> it's very heavy. It's a three pin plug. Now I'm going to show you how to connect your charger into it. What you have to do, you have to take this out. Oh dear, we went back inside again. There you go. These chargers. You see these chargers? They got holes in them. Look, look, look at it carefully. It's got holes. And these are specially designed for these kind of um, Japanese step down transformers. What this company did, who made this step down transformer, right? They made this step down transformer the items that come from Japan. Yeah? Okay. Look at this carefully now. So, this two pin plug. Hold on, which way is it? There. It goes in the Look. You think that is just hanging out like that? 
Don't worry, we don't like that. You could do it like that. Look at this. You could do it like this. Look. What's this? I'll show you carefully. Look. Look. Right there. Yeah. In these holes, these two pins will go in here. That's it. <laughs> Don't worry. It just does that. There you go. It goes in like that. Excellent, isn't it? Absolutely amazing. Okay, that's all done now. Now this is that phone, all right? This is a Vegas 2 Arrows U smartphone. Very nice. Don't worry about anything. Now this is the back. Now at the back, they use this sticker. Look at this carefully. The sticker is showing you, right, how to put a SIM card and the charger. Look, on the top picture, it told you it tells you how to put a uh, SIM card, memory card, and jet charger at the bottom. You take that off. Look, you can take it off. This is the only thing I didn't take off. I left it for you guys to enjoy. Dun, 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 dun. And we'll see what names they tagged on this phone. What the heck is this? This is pretty plain. Take a look at that. Arrows. This is a produce to bone. Usually, producer used to write producer down here. Yeah? But on this phone, they didn't write nothing. Right. Let's look at its features. Then we're going to talk more about this phone. What's in there? I'm not going to put, I'm not going to talk too much in, in this video about it too much. But we're going to. Let's go through all the basics. Front facing camera. Okay. Which I zoom is 5 megapixel. Rear camera is 8 megapixel. We will look into the camera and confirm it properly. If this front facing camera is 5 megapixel and that's 8, we will look into it properly now. Okay. Now look at these buttons. Yeah. This button down here. That one is for the camera. When you press the button, the camera app opens. Okay. This one, this long one, is plus minus volume controls. And this is the power switch. All right. And this is a C port. 
for your charger. And this is for your 3.5 millimeter jack for your earphone. All right. And here is a slot. If you look very carefully, I don't know if you can see. There's a hole. Yeah? So what you have to do there, I want to show you how to do it. Mm, hold on, it's hard to see. You put it in here, yeah? And what you do, you have to push it. <laughs> hold on, it's hard to say. You have to push it tight. Did you see that? When I pushed it in, that comes out. Yeah? This will come out. Look. It's this. I will show you this properly now. This is a nano SIM card. Okay? This is Kingston 64 GB micro SD XE card. Okay? If you look at this carefully, at this this one the sim card goes there and the micro sd card goes there okay you have to just get it the right way i'm trying to show you this but this is quite difficult to do it's not easy look at this carefully it goes in like that. Can you see? It goes in like that. If you look at it carefully, there's a cut. It goes in there. Like that. Okay? That one will go in there like that. And this one, if I can put my hands that way, Goes in like that. Hold on. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. One more thing. It goes in like that. Okay. That is all. Once you put that in. You just place the card, you stop. Into these slots.
And then what are you going to do when you've done that? You slide this thing into that slot of that phone again. Like that. Yeah? You just slide it in like that. Look. Can you see that? Yes, push it in. I don't know if you can see that properly. Push it in like that. That's it. Now with this switch, the phone powers up. Hold on, sorry. Hold on. Hmm. Wonder why didn't power up. Yeah. Looks like that. It's got nice screens. I've been using this phone, yeah? It's got really good performance. It's a really, really uh, top quality phone. It's really, really good. Look at this. Arrows. It's getting started. There you go. Really, really cool, isn't it? Now, even the reception's showing at the top. Look. Look at that. I don't know if you can see it. Same card, actually works. So, this is a really, really good device. It works really, really well. Okay. What's so special about having one of these? Why should you actually buy one of these? But just to make these s smartphones really special. Look at this. It's very strong casing. This device is waterproof. Okay. It's waterproof. I will give you more information about this device in my next video dust proof security protection military graded what this is the, you know the people who are like construction workers IT workers and up to military graded people use one of these the good thing about these right look Look, you see that? They won't break. They're really strong. Look, look at that. They're very strong. What's this? What's this? I don't want to play my ball, but but for just two goes that I don't know how high you can throw this damn thing. Look, but this device is really strong. Yeah, it's very very strong and durable uh, one of the most important thing about this device is that another thing about important thing about this thing is it's you know when you take out the box you know when you clean your device with cloths 
hygienically the dirt is still on there yeah it won't clean properly with cloths whatever things they sell on the market they will clean when you wipe the screen it's true what they're saying but in a, in a real theory the the dirt is still there the some of the germs can be still be there on the screen but how does for just to get rid of all that from the screen this screen if you look properly is very special look at it touch it well you can't touch it like i look look i'm touching it for you you know when you wash your hands okay okay these are my hands okay my hands right now they're dry yeah when we run a tap we'll put water on our hands in it and when we put water on our hands right to clean our hands properly we will use soap yes yeah, soap we will make that all that foam around our hands oh my gosh and all that ooh, all around your hands you do it properly you know when you wash your hands yeah and then with the running tap you wash it off don't you but then you have to make it dry we have to use a towel don't it hand towel we use a hand towel to make our hand dry that's the same technology on the screen you place water on it you see everything on there is covered properly the water will not go inside this you gotta be careful about this pot though honey because when you wash it you're not gonna put the water in like that because otherwise it will go inside this pot the way you're gonna wash this you're gonna run the water from top to bottom you know what if you did that with another handset they will die straight away I'm not, I'm not kidding on that they will die straight away in seconds but this one won't you will run the water from top to bottom and then what you're gonna do you're gonna use soap you're not gonna put the soap on the screen <laughs> no, no 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 you do, don't try and do that what you're gonna do right I'll explain that more in, in my next video anyway you can make the foam with your hands yeah and then you're gonna scrub that on the screen like that yeah you're gonna scrub it on the screen like that. the foam will go on the screen and what are you gonna do you're gonna do it like that properly yeah it's really made for the screen the soap foam not for the back the back can be cleaned easily but I would use it on the front and back it makes it more clean then what you're gonna do you're gonna run the you're gonna run the water yeah I will explain that properly in my next video properly how to do it step by step properly yeah because you need to understand how to do it properly otherwise you can make mistakes with it okay you gotta know step by step how to do it properly now let's go back to waterproof you know when you go outside in a very heavy rain and you take your you take this smartphone out for just two hours you yeah smartphone when the water is gonna pour on this device it won't go inside because it, it's on the top isn't it because because you're gonna do like this look you're gonna use it like this and the water is gonna go on top of it it's because this device is waterproof the water wouldn't go inside it secondly this is dust proof dust proof means look at these ports properly 
I know that one's out, but don't worry, because you're holding it like that, ain't it? A dust will not go inside this device. It wouldn't go inside. But that's what's been said. A dust will not go inside this device. It keeps it protected at all times. Security protections are, you probably already know that, the security measures yeah i'm going to show you all the security stuff that you normally use yeah look at that properly Don't you can see it properly. Uh, it's about here. Yeah. That one. That's called security. Yeah? You click on that. The, how to get to that, right? Look carefully. You touch that gear. Yeah? called settings then once you get to this screen find a thing called security which looks like this yeah on this page for security you got google play protect security update find my device and stuff like that if you look carefully in the middle you know all the stuff on this device they're different to other smartphones they're in different places you gotta you gotta you gotta know where they are you go to a thing called device security all right and under device security the first one which says security unlock preference it's all these it's none of course nothing there swipe pattern security code password you click on one of these obviously I'm not going to do them and follow the instructions you'll, you'll be into security you'll have security options so your phone will be protected okay fully that's the security options for you the next one was about the cleaning which was about the soap this will be clean like you got from out of the box now I'm gonna show you what can I actually show you this is an app called Moga Pivot yeah This device is pretty fast. Okay, I'll tell you that right now. That's app. We're gonna just close that. This is Microsoft Word. All right. Here to sign in and all that. This device performs pretty fast okay I'm not gonna play any games with it today but this thing is pretty fast in performance wise it's really really good take a look at this performance 
que se Look. Take a look at that. Look at our colleagues, look at that. It's really good. It's a really good performance. These devices. This is a very high performance device. Believe me on that. Uh, what can I show you? Okay, I'm going to show you. This is a Nintendo Dolphin emulator. Okay. Let me just add this again. For some reason, it's like corn from there. Okay, let me just. Ah, uh, the SD card problem. Let me hold, just turn it off with this button here. It turns off. Okay, what's this? You know the button here. This one. What's this? Okay, in sleep mode, yeah. And here is a volume control. You can see that. As volume control, and you know what I showed you before, right? Uh, and this one, yeah, this brings the camera poses. Hold on, oh, sorry, another one. Yeah, this one. It's hard to see. Yeah, that one. This was the camera. Watch this. Actually, it's more like a Google Assistant. It's not for the camera. Mm, very surprising. Sorry about that, it's not for the camera. Yeah, you just speak in there and then something comes up. Yeah, watch this. Go press that. Can you see that? The Google system. Google. Google. Let me do that again. Let me show you again. Google. Google. Amazon. Did you hear that? <laughs> and it really came up, look at that! Incredible, isn't it? Let's do that again. So press that again at the bottom. August.
Ini kata Agak sih udah Check it out So we're gonna check why the SD card didn't show up Now I'm gonna just switch it off with that button again As I was explaining Yeah I'll show you actually even how it turns up So you press the switch here And you just press power off And the screen looks like that And you just press OK Should I know? Let me see what the problem is. Why doesn't it work? Because when I put the SD card, it didn't actually show up. I wonder why. Okay. Well, everything looks in place. Okay, let's put this on again. She don't work. <laughs> okay, let's just, just, just wait a bit. The screens look very different when you start it up. It's got different sound effects for your notifications, you know, when someone sends you emails and all that. And text messages. There's different kind of sounds on there. It's very slim like design phone phone this is. Looks really really nice. Hmm, to be right now. Yeah, it's showing up now. Um, so hold on. Uh, use this folder. Hello. Yeah. There you go. Now this is the emulation program okay so you call it the dolphin emulator on this for just two hours you smartphone uh, I didn't actually tell you this this device has uh, hold on the GPU in this is snapdragon 450 the RAM is about 3 GB, 3 GB RAM. Uh, the internal memory is 32 GB. Uh, you can put an external micro SD card. You can put micro SD uh, uh, all sorts of micro SD work that comes under it. The website specified that that this um, can only take up to 32 GB. But in my tests, right, using the external storage, I used a micro SD XC uh, 64 GB card. It actually worked fully, fully, fully. I fully used the card and it actually worked in there. I was very surprised that this device gives you internal memory of 32 GB. Now I can get to use a, an external micro SD XC up to 64 GB card. 
which is really really good I mean especially these uh, ISOs right take a lot of memory you're probably thinking that shall we use one of them um, what shall we use then I shall use Star Fox Assault which is this one Where's it gone? Can I just click on it? It's amazing. In my upcoming videos, yeah, I will show you how to do settings, the best setting you can get for Nintendo Dolphin emulator on this. I've never actually used a Wii on this thing, but I'd love to see if Nintendo Wii can actually work on the public look at this right let me just check if the setting is right on this device there's a gear there which is at the top Yeah. All right. I'm not gonna talk too much in this. I'm just gonna see if the yeah yeah everything's right. We will talk about that in another video. So yeah, even if, even here yeah, if you look at this carefully, look. Oh, hold on. I think I meant to start. That. Look, it's a good performance, look at that. Yeah, look. And this is a really pretty advanced app. Sometimes hard to do, isn't it? Yeah, so there you go pretty good device this is really good there's one last thing I can actually show you before I go away <laughs> okay I'm going to show you something else yeah where what you else you can do with this thing Obviously, I'm not going to connect it today. I'm just going to show you the experience. This is a MOGA Pro game controller. Yeah. And down here, you just lift it up here. And you can put the device in there. All right. I'll just put it in there quickly. YouTube.
You gotta be careful because of bonsai in the way. On this device. So you gotta be careful. Check this out. You can put it in like that. Yeah? And it becomes like a game controller. Look at that. Check it out. Really, really good. You can use it like that so you can play your games on there. So, what you just do, oh, watch it, watch it, watch it. You just do that and you start playing on this thing, yeah? We're going to be showing that in another video. So, yeah, I mean, it's really, really good. This thing, this device is very, very fast. It's very, very powerful. It's pretty good. It's not very powerful, but this Fujitsu Arrows U, right? It's very competitive priced. It's got some good decent hardware because originally this device was made for for like workers and all that workers where they can listen to audio and video and use internet access and send tech uh, phone calls text messages you know because like when people are in serious situations they could phone from this thing is really good and they could do video calling from this thing uh, when a person's like kind of bored he can play some music tracks on this thing and watch videos now this was a really important thing I know you might think that what's so good about playing audio tracks or playing videos that is when when the person's working, some people prefer to, when they're working like in construction work, they like to keep the device at the front like that. And they want to put the sound on, like music and all that. And stuff like that. And and play the film so they can, while they're working, doing stuff like that. Cutting all, going talk, 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 talk with a hammer. They're watching at the same time. They're doing stuff. They're like, they're multitasking at the same time. That's what they're doing. Because this kind of device is very solid. Even if it slips on the ground, it won't break so easily. Because this is a very useful piece of thing, that's what it is. And the hardware this device uses, it's really good for uh, web mail, web browsing. It's very fast for web browsing, yeah? Apps, music, videos, and you got Snapdragon 450 for your gaming in this thing. Yeah, this thing plays pretty fast gaming. Mm, it's really good. Trust me on that. It's really, really impressive what gaming this thing is. You will soon know when I'm gonna be playing some stuff on this thing. I mean, I was so surprised how good this thing was for gaming. And even the price you pay for this thing, man. It's, it's got a lot of features, good technology, high performance and you can play a lot of Android games and emulators on this thing. This thing's crazy man. I I reckon this thing is really good. Once I show you this thing, you will actually know more of it. When I'm show you some action on this thing. It's really really good man. In my upcoming videos I'm going to be showing you more on this thing. So today um, show what I've been talking about this thing today it's been useful to you and you must have liked what I've been talk, uh, talking about this thing and all that so I will see you in my next video give your likes comment subscribe thanks for watching bye for now